Why, yes, I did make this intro. Thank you for noticing. It... it sucks. Fuck you. I would consider myself a vlog connoisseur at this point. From Logan Paul to Wolfie Raps, even a bit of FoosyTube. And I'm sure you all remember how hurt I was when Casey Neistat decided to blow up my heart like Hiroshima. It's not clickbait. I really am ending the vlog. Fucking Casey. I will never forgive you. But since I have such an inquenchable thirst for good vlogs, I'm always on the hunt for new talent, looking for the next big magical glimpse into the life of someone who isn't stuck in their basement 23 hours a day, seven days a week. Unlock the door, PC. I have to go to the bathroom. I think what you have to do is find a new vlog channel, actually. Fucking computer piece of shit. And as luck would have it, I think I found yet another exceptional vlog channel for us to enjoy today. The channel is called Toddy Smithy. Quite an original channel name for quite an impressive assortment of content. Boasting such masterworks as, can't believe he touched that. Can't believe we got caught doing this. And who could forget? Can't believe he cut me. As you can tell, there's a lot of non-believers on this channel. Now, while all these videos just look downright incredible, I think I'm gonna have to go with Can't Believe This Happened, parentheses, LOL. There's just something about that title that's speaking to me. I don't know if it's the ambiguity, maybe, or it could be the lower casing of the LOL. I don't know, really, but I'm sure that I'm gonna enjoy it. What's up, guys? Scott and I are going to the gym right now. Okay, so I'm not sure if you know this, Toddy Smithy, but if you're gonna do the whole pre-roll into the intro, which is great, by the way, great intro. Uh, boring screen with the Kiss Me song really works. Wonders. But if you're going to pull something like that, generally you want to pull in the audience with something that's... How should I say this? Interesting? Now, I'm not saying that going to the gym with music bumping while you yell at a camera isn't fun. I'm just saying that it's a pretty common thing for people to do. Hell, I do it all the time. Except the second part. I'm just saying that you might want to open a little stronger next time. Also, I, I know I kind of said that your opening card was good. I was really just trying to spare your feelings. To make it up to you, let me give you a bit of a redesign real quick. There we go. Free improvements from your friendly shark. And today, Scott and I are going to be taking ginger shots. Woo! They're not just ginger, they're lemon, ginger, turmeric, cayenne, achicnea, and Himalayan salt. Come on, cameraman, get your head out of your ass. You know you're supposed to read ingredients off to the man before you hand him any kind of beverage. Ah, tastes good! I have several questions, but I think the first should probably be, why the slow motion to drink the tiny drink? Is that a common trait for your videos, to spice up any boring situations. You know, it's not actually a bad idea. Well, what do you think? Didn't have the same effect- what the fuck? I slowed down the video. I'm always shirtless. Ah, fuck. It's because I didn't wear pants to have them randomly unzipped and tease my package to all my young female fans, isn't it? Damn it! I've gotta find a way to sex up this basement. Hey guys, welcome back to Toddy's vlog. I'm totally making this up on the spot, but I think we're gonna remove Toddy's ear piercing. Should I think we, we are, yeah. Should we do it? You, you said it hurt you, so might as well. To the next video. Oh, you want the hype? Oh, guys, tune in next week. Wow. I didn't think he could do it. I didn't think he could make me this... excited. Like hell yeah, dude. This dude's about to take his earring out on camera. You know, I don't think I've ever seen something that revolutionary on here. Could he be creating a new YouTube subgenre in the earring removal field? Hold the fuck up. Oh, apparently that subgenre is already taken. 11,700 times taken, actually. Oh well, I'm still hyped. Subscribe.
We got the plane. Oh my god! Yo, we have a place to live. Oh fuck. Also, she lives six doors down. You're about to kill a pinata. Woo! Uh, what? So we go from shirtless, dreadlocked man standing in the background trying to pull off what looks like an extended leg Captain Morgan pose. And I can't say that it's not working. But from that, we take the next logical step to throwing tomahawks at pinatas. Uh, this must be a metaphor for... Nope. Nope. I, I don't know what's happening. I, dude, I honestly, I swear on my life... Okay, shirtless, what the fuck? You're kind of overpowering me here with testosterone. Having no shirt, I get it. It's a freeing experience. Let's the pecs kind of breathe. But when you're tugging at the nuts, okay, just, just cupping the balls in the background there, I mean, it's just kind of a little awkward for me. I don't know, M maybe I'm a little old fashioned. Hey guys, um, I don't even know what to say. What do I say on Todd's channel? This camera zooms nicely. The camera has world's fastest autofocus. Boom, focus, boom, focus. You know, it's this kind of meaningful, funny, thought provoking interaction that really just draws me to a vlog. You just don't get this anywhere else. There's a certain level of connection that you feel with these people. I mean, I've really begun to form a connection with these guys. I mean, you've got Toddy over there, of course. Then you've got, um, Ball Cap here. And finally, Marty McOpenfly. I will cherish this. Oh my god, I've only been watching this video for 2 minutes and 55 seconds? Seems like so much longer. Peace. Later. Woo! That's it? You don't, you don't even tell him to like and subscribe? Comment the fire emoji if you think Todd is cute. Comment the dolphin if you think I'm cute. Oh, God. Decisions, decisions. Toddy or ball cap? Fire or dolphin? Both are so delectable. I just don't know who to choose. On one hand, you've got Toddy. He's got the nose ring. Uh, chest full of tattoos. And I think that's like Buddha right there in the middle or something. Telling me that he's a pretty chill dude. Then... On the other hand, you got yourself Ball Cap. He sat on a ledge in the parking garage. And didn't even take his shirt off one time in this video. You know what? I think the answer is actually pretty clear. Aquaman. Anyways, that's the video, guys. Like it, don't like it, let me know. I made this video because they clickbaited their title, so I just mocked them a bit. Also, if any of you Toddy Smithy fans actually find this somehow and inform me that this guy isn't Toddy, I'm aware. It was a joke. This guy is actually Toddy, and it took me three times to actually pick up on that because he's rarely even on camera for his own fucking vlog. And another thing, maybe it's just my dislike of vlogs, but this video was awful. At least when I watch something like a Casey Neistat vlog, I know what he's doing and why he's going to these places and how he got there. But when I watched this one, one minute they were excited about getting a new house. And the next minute, they're throwing tomahawks at a goddamn pinata. <laughs> Not even bothering to tell us how we got to that point. But maybe that's just one of those classic vlog rituals that I just haven't been acclimated to yet. Shark pride for life, bruh. Push your hands, 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 h